Vicky said that the hardest part for her isn't the dying, it's leaving my children behind that breaks my heart. Yesterday at just past midnight, Vicky's battle with terminal cervical cancer ended. Her young life ended. Her life stolen by a vicious disease, her life stolen by profound failures of the state, of government, and of the HSE. Enormous and endless tributes flow now for this remarkable, irreplaceable woman. She was a study in resilience, determination, and grace under pressure. No words of mine will fully capture the depth of her courage or of her love. No words will fully capture the scale of devastation at her loss for Jim, for Amelia, for Dara, for Gabby and John, and for all who loved her dearly. Ireland has lost one of its brightest stars in the firmament of noble women. Ireland must not forget. Ireland must change. Safe health care, respectful health care for Manoana Heron, that was Vicky's battle cry. Let it echo from the rooftops. The women of Ireland, thank you, Vicky. Eriesje Gorev Aanam.